What's up guys? So I realized I forgot the audio aspect of OBS and this is obviously going to be an important part because how are you going to stream if you don't have audio? Now you need to make sure that your mixer has a built-in interface or your controller, which most controllers do, they have a built-in interface. Once you have ensured that it has that, you need to plug the cable from your mixer or your controller into your laptop or your Mac or whatever you are using. Once that is done, you're going to need to head over to OBS. Once in OBS, you will go again to the plus icon. Once you click on the plus icon, you will look for input, audio input capture. That will be right on top. Once you click on that, you'll see it says create new or add existing. Now, I've already added it because I obviously stream. Now, I'm assuming that you haven't done this before, so let me just walk you through the process. You'll click on create new, you click OK. Now, with your cable plugged in, from the drop down menu, you'll select whatever your controller or your mixer that you are using. So I'm using a Z2 mixer, so I'll just select that from the drop down menu. Once you have done that, you can just proceed to play a song. So for example, let me play a song. And you'll see the audio would be captured by uh, OBS. Now, if you're going to stream, all you need to do basically is you're going to need to head over to the stream tab or the settings, first settings, then the stream, the stream tab. Now, if you're streaming from Facebook Live, all you need to do is click the service below. Go over to Facebook and start the live video. It will give you a stream key. That stream key you will then enter or you'll just paste it over here where it says stream key. Once that is done, you click OK and then you can say start streaming. And then there you go, you will stream. Now, I would like to say that there are videos out there if you want to get more in depth with OBS. I left the links in the description for you. So you can just follow that. Please go to the description because I've, I've basically given everything possible that you could possibly need in order to do that now i forgot to add as well if you are going to live stream to let's say for example um we're going to live stream to instagram there is a way at which you can do that using the same process as hooking up your phone to obs and playing through your system the only other alternative or the only other thing that you need to add is you need to download yellow duck once Yellow Duck has been downloaded, I left it, I think I, oh, I will leave the link in the description. Once that is downloaded, you enter your login details and it will basically give you a stream key which you then enter into OBS. The same process as you did with the Facebook Live thing. So then you will enter it in there and then you can stream to Instagram as well. I hope you found this video useful and I apologize once again for forgetting about the audio aspect of OBS. So I will catch you in the next video. Peace.